Being on set may seem like a dream come true, but have you ever wondered about the strict rules actors have to follow? In this video, we'll take a sneak peek into the life of Jenna Ortega, who had to learn how to act with her eyes and not blink while playing Wednesday in The Addams Family. From the crazy filming schedule to the freezing temperatures on set, you won't believe the challenges Jenna faced. But hey, it's all worth it when you get to bring a character to life, so get ready to learn about the struggles and sacrifices actors make to make their performances unforgettable. Let's get started. Learn to act with your eyes. So imagine you're an actress and you've been offered the role of Wednesday in The Addams Family. Sounds like a dream come true, right? But hold up, there's a catch. The director, Tim Burton, wants you to look emotionless and walk without moving your hands. He even asks your coach to make you act like you have a stack of books or a teacup on your head. But that's not all. You also have to learn how to only play with your eyes. Yep, you heard that right. No blinking allowed. Jenna Ortega, the actress who played Wednesday, confessed that it was probably the scariest job she ever took on. But she was up for the challenge. She doesn't blink. He likes it when I tilt my chin down and look through my eyebrows, kind of a cubic stare, and then I relax all of the muscles on my face. So I go, oh my gosh. <laughs> she learned how to give Wednesday's uncomfortable glare, which was actually invented on the set of the show. And guess what? It all started because Jenna did a take where she didn't blink at all. Tim Burton loved it so much that he asked her not to blink anymore. Now imagine having to act without moving your hands, without showing any emotion on your face, and without blinking. Sounds pretty tough, right? Well, there was one actor on set who faced an even bigger challenge. She had to learn how to act with his eyes. Talk about pressure. Crazy filming schedule. Jenna, the superstar of the show, had to wake up at the crack of dawn like seriously, 4.30 in the morning, but she was a trooper. Always ready to tackle the day ahead. She had less than an hour to get herself together before her ride arrived at 5.20 a.m. sharp. That's barely enough time to brush your teeth, let alone look like a million bucks, but Jenna managed to pull it off. She's a pro like that. Then it was off to the set where the real magic happened. At 6 a.m., Jenna would transform into her character with the help of the makeup team. Can you imagine spending an hour and a half in the makeup chair? That's like watching two whole episodes of your favorite TV show. But wait, it gets even better. From 8 to 8.30 a.m., the actors would have to do some serious blocking. That's when they would learn where to stand and how to move on a particular set. It's like a choreographed dance, but with more drama and less jazz hands. Finally, after a long day of shooting scenes and munching on snacks in between takes, Jenna would head off to stunt rehearsal. Yes, you read that right. Jenna and the other actors had to perform their own stunts, which meant getting thrown around and pushed up against giant trees. Ouch! But hey, they wanted to make the show as authentic as possible, and they definitely succeeded. Freezing filming. First of all, did you know that the Nevermore Academy isn't just a set, but a real-life castle in Romania? The Kentuckazina Castle served as the exterior of the spooky boarding school, and it's absolutely gorgeous. But that's not all. The interiors were filmed in another location, the Montiora House in Bucharest. Now, some of the actors had a blast filming in Romania. Joy Sunday, who plays Bianca, said that the castle and the neighborhood around it were a beautiful environment to be in. In fact, the cast even took a mini vacation in the mountains to shoot some scenes. Sounds like fun, right? Well, not according to Jenna Ortega, the star of the show. She revealed that the eight months she spent in Romania were quite challenging, to say the least. For starters, the cast never had any hot water. Yep, you read that right. No hot water for eight months. The boilers in two of my apartments were broken, Jenna explained, so I always took cold showers. And if that wasn't enough, the bulk of the show was filmed during the cold months. Frigid temperatures and lockdowns due to the pandemic made everything even more difficult. It feels like we survived something, Jenna said. But hey, that's what makes this show so special. The cast and crew went through so much to bring this incredible story to life. Stuck in bubble. You're on the set of your favorite TV show, but there's a catch. You're stuck in a bubble. That's right. The cast had to get used to isolation, which was tough for everyone. Being so far away from home and unable to leave the premises was a bummer. But luckily, they had each other for company. But after what felt like ages, things started to open up and the actors could finally venture out into the world. 
Hunter Duhan and Ricky Lindholm even went on a wild adventure to Transylvania to see Dracula's castle and the salt mines. How cool is that? Unfortunately, not everyone got to go home for Christmas. Georgie Farmer and Emma Myers had to stay behind due to their filming schedule, and it seemed like they were the only ones left in Romania. Speaking of Emma, she had to follow a unique rule. She was the only cast member who couldn't eat garlic because of her character's storyline. Struggles of bringing a character to life. The actor who played the character that followed Wednesday around like a puppy had a seriously tough job. Not only did he have to stay hidden right next to Jenna Ortega without being noticed, but he also had to wear a full blue suit that covered every inch of his body except for one hand. Can you imagine spending hours in the makeup chair to get your tattoos blocked, a stump glued on, and all the stitches applied? Yikes! But it doesn't end there. This actor, Romanian magician Victor Durabantu, had to get creative with hiding in the most unusual places to get the perfect shot. From upside down under floors to behind walls, and even inside walls, he did it all. Jenna Ortega even recalled desks with drawers removed and man-shaped holes and mattresses to help Victor interact with the other cast members without being seen. And as if that wasn't enough, Victor had to act using only his hand and show emotions without a voice. Plus, the language he communicated in was a mix of American Sign Language signs that scuba divers and Marine Corps use, along with sheer improvisation. Can you believe it? Playing a hand turned out to be much tougher than expected. So the next time you watch a movie, remember all the hard work that goes into bringing a character to life. The strict rules Jenna Ortega had to follow on set while bringing Wednesday Adams to life were no easy feat. From acting with her eyes to enduring freezing temperatures, it's clear that this cast and crew went through a lot to make this incredible show. But what do you think? Would you be able to handle these rules if you were in Jenna's shoes? And are you excited to see what other challenges the cast will face in season two? Let us know in the comments below. And as always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more behind-the-scenes glimpses into your favorite TV shows and movies. See you next time.